What is going on, people? It is your boy, Daddy Mac, and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. I am extremely hyped up for this matchup because we are against your boy, King Slime, aka Slime Com Cobain. I don't know why I almost butchered that, but he's bringing a really threatening team. He got my favorite Pokemon, Victini. Another of my favorite Pokemon, and you guys are going to say I'm cliche because I like her Shifu. He's got the Glass Rider, the Garchomp, which we all know is a threat from my one of my previous Wi-Fi battles. Azumi the Azumarill and Hatterim. Um, I gotta be careful for the Trick Room. I see a Hatterim or a Hatterine, and I see a Glass Rider, I automatically think Trick Room. So I think what I'm gonna do to start things off, I really want to hit that Hatterim like a truck. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go Darmanitan. Hold up a minute, hold up a minute, hold up, hold up. I gotta hurry up. I'm gonna start Zoroark, go Zatu, Dustlop, start. I'm gonna put Darmanitan last, just like the last Wi Fi battle, because that came in pretty clutch for me. Let the best man win, my boy. Um, hold on. I'm just messaging my boy real quick. All right. You already know this is gonna be a pay-per-view right here. My boy looking pretty fresh with that dress shirt. Got the eyepiece, he got Buttercup, the Azumarill, which is actually a very good lead for him. Yeah, this is actually one of the best leads he could have gone with, to be honest. What I'm gonna do though, Sludge, I got the Sludge Bomb and I'm Specs. You already know we about to hit that Sludge Bomb, my boys. Come on, knock it out, we're Specs. We're Specs. We barely miss it. We barely, barely miss it. It's probably, um, I'm pretty sure that's a belly drum. Come on, predict the switch. Hey, he probably thought I was going to switch out, but Darmanitan, aka Zoroark, is coming in clutch. Okay, Aqua Jet does not phase us. We should be able to take two of those. And here comes my Zoroark. So beautiful Zoroark putting in a clutch work against my, my girl Izumi, Buttercup. Very cool. That actually played pretty well in my in my opinion because um, there's just something on my screen here um, Because buttercup is a big threat against my team. I mean, it's a water type So that, that automatically it checks my Terrakion it checks my Darmanitan and you already saw how much damage it did to my boy Zoroark So we're not about to stay in what I'm gonna do here is I am gonna go into Dusclops And I'm gonna hope that this is a special attacking big teeny most of the time they are physical with the V-Create. I don't think this one's running V-Create. Prove me wrong, though. Okay, what you gonna do? U-turn. Very good move for my opponent. That is the best move he could have used, to be honest. Because now he got Switch Initiative. And he can bring in something to kind of counter my Dusclops. I have not evolved Dusclops yet, by the, by the way. Okay, here comes Single Striker Shifu, which I absolutely hate. In a good way. Um... Because it wrecks my team. It absolutely wrecks my team. Do I let Dusclops go down? I think Dusclops is a little... I think it's... Um, I think it's worth keeping Dusclops around. Um, but at the same time, I do not want to take an attack from this thing. I really don't know what to do here. I can't really do much to it, so I'm gonna go ahead and switch out really quick. Do I want to switch out? Oh my goodness, I don't know what to do. So I got Dusclops in. He's probably gonna go for the Dark type move. I can go Terrakion. Oh, I'm gonna go Terrakion. Hit me with that Dark type attack. I dare you. I, I would be cool with it. Hit me with the Dark type attack. I know it's gonna be a crit, and it's gonna essentially neutralize the not very effective portion. So here comes a wicked blow. Get me with that justified. I'm all I'm all for it. That still did a lot of damage. It's a crit! Obviously, it's a crit. And this is why I went into my boy Terrakion, because I'm bandit, I'm technically plus two. That's this is the sword that Terrakion right now. And what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna close combat. If you go Hatterim, you go Hatterim. I really don't care. But this thing's going down. Soy Young is going down. Very his nickname to his Pokemon are absolutely stunning. I love him. All right, another big threat taken down by my boy Terrakion. And you can come into Hatterim. I'm going to switch into Dusclops. And it's going to be GG's. 
my confidence has been way up here since that last Wi-Fi battle. Okay, here comes Victini. Another good switch in on my opponent's side. I can't really do much to it, so I'm gonna get the hashtag out of here. And I'm just gonna go into Dusclops again. That's my best switch in against Victini because I resist the U-turn. I should be able to take a physical attack from this thing. As long as it's not banded, because if it's banded, we're we're in trouble. Give him the pressure. Come on, hit me with that physical attack. Energy ball. So this is mixed. We should be able to take this regardless. Dusclops is tanky. You guys are sleeping on Dusclops, just FYI. I'm going to hold your guys here. I think that's the best play I got. I can basically scout what item my opponent has on any of his Pokemon if he switches or does not switch out. So, Wiguchi. I've been waiting for this battle for a, a whole week, man. Thank you for having this Wi-Fi battle with me. I really appreciate it, King Slime. MVP. Okay. Comes the Glass Rider, which is actually very scary. And he's got an Assault Vest. Very cool. Very cool. How much is it going to do, though? Nothing. Yikes. I obviously don't want a Zatu here. I do want to save Zoroark. Scizor is pretty uh, tempting, though. Do I really need you? I do. As much as I say I don't need you, I really do. I just don't know what to do. I don't want this thing to set up a trick room and then boom, there you have it. I'm gone. I think Zoroark did what it got to do, though. Because, um, yeah, we're just going to Zorak. I'm going to take this guy's a Darmanitan, but he's going to hit me with an attack and he's going to knock me out. That's the bottom line. High horsepower. What? Darmanitan Zorak. Okay. He's probably going to think this is really Darmanitan after this. He's a salt vest, though, so it's not going to phase him. Oh, my boy. Oh, my boy. Oh my boy, I, I just can't. I just can't. Okay. I really wish. Okay, I'm gonna switch out here. Here comes my boy Dusclops. Come on, Dusk. The pressure is in. The pressure is on. Okay, here comes Fusion Bolt. What? Okay, I gotta go open the door for my girlfriend. BRB! Okay, back to business. We're just gonna shadow sneak, to be honest. I really, I kinda wanna skitter smack at the same time, but I'm gonna shadow sneak this thing. I'm not afraid of my boy Victini. Okay, Blast Riot comes out. This was expected. This was expected because now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go into Zatu. He's gonna hit me with that high horsepower and I'm gonna teleport out of there. So he's gonna high horsepower right here. And when I come into Zatu, I'm just gonna teleport. That's what we gonna do. Hit me with that high horsepower, my boy. Oh, oh no. That didn't play well. So I still need Zatu. Do I? It's my wish Pokemon. I do. I absolutely do need it. I'm just going to teleport here. I'm going to predict the ice type attack. Maybe even dark. But I'm going to come into Caesar here. Oh, he outspeeds me. I didn't think he'd outspeed. I have speed investment. He must be trained in speed also. That's not very common for a glass rider. So, unfortunately, we go down here. And I'm honestly going to come into... Zorark again. No. What do I do here? What do I do here? Um, the momentum is still on. It's still quite pretty even. I feel like momentum's starting to go on his side, though. A little bit more. I'm going to go into Zor Zorak, a.k.a. Darmanitan. And I'm honestly just going to... Night days. No, I'm you turning out of there. I feel like I have to get out of there. Switch into Victini. Switch into Victini. I dare you, my boy. I dare you. So the reason I'm U-turning here is because next I'm going to come into Darmanitan. And I'm just going to um, hit something with an Earthquake. 
some damage on any Pokemon is pretty good. Carefully thinking out his play. I think it's one of those battles where you have to think every move carefully. Otherwise, one wrong move and it's going to bite you. He's probably not expecting this U-turn, though. And here comes our Manitan next turn. I'm Scarfed, so I should be able to take this thing out. Boom. Okay. Now I'm coming to real Darmanitan here. So this is cool. Kept the real Darm. My best Pokemon on this team. I love Darmanitan, man. It's one of my favorite Pokemon. There's a lot of Pokemon that I say are my favorite, but Darmanitan, ever since I've used... Have you used Choice Band to Darmanitan? Seriously? It hits like a truck. Great White comes out. The... Guard Chomp, which is absolutely that, that's a good play, but I earthquake for this very reason, and it's a beautiful shiny Guard Chomp. So I'm obviously not gonna stay against Great White. Unfortunately, I lost Zatu. I'm just gonna Dusclops here. I just cannot, I cannot allow Guard, um, not Guard Chomp, Darmanitan to go down, and I cannot allow Guard Chomp to take my Darmanitan down. So I need a Darmanitan as an MVP for this Wi-Fi battle. So we're gonna Dusclops. Hopefully I can take an attack from this thing. Come on, take an earthquake. Oh, stealth rock. Good play. Good play. Go for rocks. What I'm gonna do, I'm honestly just gonna shadow sneak. Very good play with the stealth rock. It's gonna come in clutch too. And now he has me thinking a little bit. What is gonna be my next move against this thing? The fans are in good for a good Wi-Fi battle. Okay, we're going to Shadow Sneak here and do a little bit of damage. Not going to be so much, but I wanted to take this thing. Fire Blast! That caught me off guard. I should be able to take a few more of those. Okay. Definitely. And I kind of want to Skitter Smack here to lower this thing's special attack even more. We're going to do it. You're going to miss, my boy. Don't do it. All right, Skitter Smack. Here we go. Boom. Lowered special attack, so now this guard chomp is, is pitiful against my, my team. We're gonna poltergeist. In case you want to switch out. I'm either taking guard chomp or, or I'm gonna do some damage on something. Bring in the glass riot. There you go. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that switch. I'm gonna poltergeist here. And okay, I thought I missed for a second. Okay. I'll take these damages. And I think I'm pretty sure that Dusclops did its job. Very good job, Dusclops. Even though I have not evolved it, this is absolutely good. This is a good thing for us. Very good thing for us. Okay. He's going to Icicle Crash. He hits me. And I think this is the point where... Oh, you live, Dusclops. What? Okay. Here we go. Dusclops... He's about to be thumbnail. Glass right goes down. I was not expecting that, and I'm so sorry about that, Slime. I really am. This is dope. This is really cool. This is a Wi-Fi battle, guys. Seriously, make sure you leave a like if you haven't already. Or subscribe. Do both, actually. Okay. We're gonna Shadow Sneak because it's super effective. Oh, okay. Here comes the guard chomp. Oh, no cap the Hatterene. That is, that's a good nickname. No cap on the Hatterene. I keep calling it Hatterene, but it's Hatterene. Boom, that's still super effective. And I might even outspeed this next turn. This is leftovers. I'm not gonna look it up. I'm not gonna look it up. I'm just gonna play the guessing game and we're gonna pull guys and hope we outspeed. If we outspeed, this is dope. Hey, we don't outspeed, okay. I knew I should have shadow sneaked, but that's a learning experience here, right? It's Pokemon. Okay. I was not expecting this to outspeed, so we're kind of in a bind now. The good news is that I can literally, unless it has a Mystic Fire, I can come into... I'm going to go into Zoroark, actually. I got no problem going to Zoroark and then hitting this thing with the Sledge Bomb. Okay. Here comes the Zoroark. And we're just going to Sludge Bomb. Sludge Bomb. 
I was gonna night days, but sludge bomb is times two because it's super effective. So that's what we're gonna do. If he switches, he switches. I don't mind it. We should be able to take out Garchomp if he switches in. Victini is probably gonna get knocked out too because we're choice spec. So Zoro are coming in clutch. Okay. Here comes Great White the Garchomp. He sacks it off, which is a good play. He saw some value in the Hatterene, so he's gonna keep it. And boom. Not very effective, but it does damage. Zoro are coming in clutch also. That's that's what? Two knockouts right there? Three maybe with the Victini? We're gonna try to we're gonna try this. We're gonna try this. Knock it out. Knock this Victini out. If he knocks me out, then I'm gonna be a little bit upset, but it's still winnable. It's still very winnable. I mean taking out Azumarill and Urshifu. On those early turns made a big difference. He got the V create. Way to catch me off guard. That is dope. That's my favorite move ever. That is lit. Okay. So Victini is a little slow, unfortunately, for my opponent. So what I'm gonna do here? Honestly, I kind of want to. No, don't play it stupid, my boy. We gotta play Terrakion. For this last Wi-Fi battle, this is a good battle. Last Wi-Fi battle with this team. Okay, so if you guys have not seen the update under my channel, I've made a little post thing that I don't do very often, which I should. But anyways, we're going to stop until Wi-Fi Battle 125. Today, the release date to Diamond and Pearl uh, remakes were announced, and I think it was November 19th. So you already know, we, we're going to take a break from Pokemon, focus on other video games, like Naruto. I've been wanting to play some Naruto Shinobi, Shinobi Striker for a while, so... We're going to focus on Naruto, maybe. I don't know what game we're going to be playing, but we're going to do... We're going to take a break from Pokemon up to after Wi-Fi Battle 125 and just chill. Chill until Diamond and Pearl remakes come out. Okay, we're going to Earthquake here. And um, probably won't knock this out because it's pretty bulky. And then Hanarine is going to knock us out instead with the Draining Kiss. Boom. We're going down. Yikes! Okay. I really wanted Darmanitan, but I think Scizor has not had a, a chance to shine within these three Wi-Fi battles. So we're going to go ahead and come into Scizor. And you already know. You already know. I think you guys also know what team we're going to be using next. Or have an idea of what team we're going to... What Pokemon we're going to be building around next. If you guys watched the last, wi the last six Wi-Fi battles, you probably know. I'm honestly gonna bullet punch here. It's super effective. We're technician. It's probably gonna knock out. And that should be it for this Wi-Fi battle. Imagine he just surprisingly outspeeds and just hits me with that mystical fire. I'd be a little upset. Okay. Caesar comes out. Bullet punch. No cap! Gets taken out. And it was almost down to the wire. That was that was a good Wi-Fi battle. Thank you for that, Slime Cobain. I appreciate it. King Slime coming in clutch with the Wi-Fi battle. I was actually hoping to get a Wi-Fi battle with uh, with a follower, subscriber, friend, somebody, and Cobain came in clutch. So thank you. I'm taking your lead card because you look fresh. I really appreciate it. Hit me up for another Wi-Fi battle soon. For real, though. Make sure you guys leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe to my channel for more Wi-Fi battles and other content because we're expanding. It's your boy, Daddy Mac, signing off. I'll see you guys next time.